During the recent T20 International Series between Australia and India, Team India had their best ever season, winning 9 out of their 11 games to finish with a 90% win-loss record for the 2020 international season. While that is an enviable record, PNG Barmandis registered the highest T20 international win-loss record in 2019 at 87.5%, placing them in the top 5 highest win percentages in T20 internationals for a calendar year. Between 1st January and 31st December 2019, the Baramandis played in 16 completed matches, winning 14 as they blazed their way to their first appearance at the ICC Men's T20 World Cup, beating the likes of Vanuatu, Bermuda, Scotland and the Netherlands along the way. The Baramandis' incredible run started with the ICC East Asia Pacific T20 World Cup regional qualifiers against the Philippines and Vanuatu played at Amini Park, Port Moresby. Papua New Guinea comfortably qualified for the World Cup qualifiers later in the year. The regional qualifiers were followed by the Pacific Games against Samoa, Vanuatu and New Caledonia in Apia, Samoa. Another series brought another sweep for the Baramandis, winning all their matches over their Pacific neighbours to live with the gold medal. The Barmanis began the qualifiers on fire, winning their first two matches by 10 wickets and 80 runs against Namibia and Bermuda. At this point, the Bar's winning streak stood at 10 wins from 10 completed T20 international matches. But that came to a halt with a narrow four-run loss to Scotland. The Barmandis hit back from that loss, winning their next four matches, including a come-from-behind win against Kenya, to register a thumping 45-run win and seal a birth in 2021 ICC Men's T20 World Cup in India. 2019 was a fantastic year for the Barmandis. Unfortunately, the Bars could not continue their rich vein of form in 2020, owing to the COVID-19 pandemic. However, should they need motivation, it comes in a figure, 87.5, their chart-topping 2019 winning percentage. The PNG Barmandis have several upcoming fixtures in 2021, all in the lead-up to their October 2021 debut at the ICC Men's T20 World Cup in India.